Precious team, how you all doing? Hello, 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 hello. <laughs> I'm blushing this period like you can't blame me. I'm blushing this period though. I am just blushing. Gucci is just blushing. Gucci is just blushing. Good cheese is just blushing, blushing. <laughs> oh, wow, you guys, how are you all doing this morning? I hope you all are doing great, great, great. Today is one of those fantastic days, you know. Ask me what is going to be happening today. Yeah, today we are visiting a friend, and that's um, one of the things we're going to be doing today. So, Sometimes you have to give some special people special treatment. We all are special, right? We are all special and wonderfully made. But you know, some people are special in your life. Sometimes when you meet some good people, you want to return goodness and kindness to them. And you want to give them so much love for them to know that they are well loved and appreciated. So we couldn't go for the, for the husband's birthday. We couldn't attend the husband's birthday because it was a busy weekend. I even thought maybe the birthday was cancelled. Like, I thought the birthday was changed, like the date was changed because um, it connived with a wedding that we did and we all had to be in that wedding. So, we couldn't make it to that uh, birthday. So, we called them and let them know we'll be coming to visit and yeah it's our visiting day so before we go there guys we're going to go to the store and get some fruits i don't know how i feel if i'm going somewhere and i don't have something going to visit especially if they had an occasion or if it's something i don't know i just feel like if i'm going out to visit sometimes i want to go with some food i want to cook something or card or flour or buy some fruits you know I don't know how does it work with you i i really don't know it doesn't make me feel good if i'm going for visiting it's just like if we're traveling to go and visit a family i want to prepare something for them you know chim chim puff puff akara you know something very interesting especially for us especially for us who are here in the diaspora i want to do something very different something that person will see and be like wow i missed this you know something like that that's just me I don't know if it's okay, but I don't think it's a bad thing, you know. Some people don't even like it, you know, but some people who are really homely, they do appreciate it, you know. You know, you never can please everybody. So that's our activities for today. It's visiting day and I'm going to be having fun with friends and family. So we are even going to go to Uncle Chukukere's house. You all know Uncle Chukukere, yeah. We're going to drop uh, Emanuela there. That's my husband's uncle. He just got a new place and we just, um, we've been there actually, but we're going to, it's close to where we are going to. Where he moved to is close to where we are going to. So we'll drop Emanuela there and head up to the family. And after that, we'll be coming home. If I get home, guys, I want to make this delicious salad. My husband have been making me this salad like, for years, he used to make me this salad when I was working. My co-workers, they used to love when my husband bring me. Uh, it's a beautiful memory and I just want to refresh it again. You know, my husband taught me a lot of salad recipes, like American salad recipes, and they are so fantastic. So I'm going to be making that salad as soon as we get back. And I have a beautiful recipe coming up on coconuts. So you guys, stay tuned. I hope you have subscribed. If you haven't done so, please do. I'm, I'm working hard. Help your girl too. Let me get all those thumbs up. Okay? I thumbs up on people's videos. I comment on people's videos. And I expect the same thing. If you can drop beautiful comments, why not? You can just thumbs up. It doesn't... Does it, really, does it cost anything to thumbs up? If there's something I don't understand here. What is that thumbs up all about? Why is it difficult for people to thumbs up? You know? Alright guys, I'm going to see you guys soon. Let's get right into this video okay stay tuned and enjoy god bless you thank you for all your love and support i appreciate you all mm -hmm. so guys i'm here to quickly pick some fruits so we are going to visit our family friend today yeah they had a birthday party and uh, 
we couldn't make it because we were busy with other things which was very important we had a wedding the same day they did their birthday so we decided we're going to go and see them so this weekend is all about visiting 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 i hope you guys will enjoy this visiting visiting vlog with us i just quickly stopped at the store because my husband and i are going to visit those family so for me i like to visit with healthy 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 fruits so here i'm trying to get some fruits birthday is over so what else you just want to go and see them with something well i don't like going to visit my friends and family without having something you know for real are you like me let me know in the comment section I like to go visit with something I don't know for some reason this is how we do it from Nigeria though we do not visit without without going with something I don't know if you understand so for me for going to visit we must go with something very reasonable so we are taking this for sure we are taking this we are going with this I tell you guys, these are healthy fruits. These are healthy fruits. This is blackberry. And this is raspberries. It's very good. These are healthy fruits. These are blueberries. So we are going with all the berries, berries, berries. Yes, we are going with all the berries, berries, berries. We are going with all the berries. I want a very big watermelon. You can choose any of these sometimes, you know, but um, sometimes I just want to go with a whole bunch of fruit so they can just cut it down themselves and do whatever they like to do. Sorry about the noise. I want to take watermelon, but I want a whole watermelon because these ones are cut ones, but I don't want to go with cut ones. I like to take some peaches plum this is plum do you know this fruit this is plum okay and these are peaches this is another shade of plum all of these are plum they have different shades some people don't know the difference between plum, peaches, and so on. But yeah, these are these are peaches, these are plums. All of these are plums, and they are organic, organic. Okay. So this was two are plums. This was are plums. Here are peaches. It looks like apple, right? But this is not apple, this is peach. So you have different types of peach. You have different types of peach. I'll show you the difference between this and apple. All of these are peaches and plum. This is another type of peach. And you see, this is another shade of peach have different types of peaches. Okay. This 
ones are sold for two something and these ones are sold for one something we have pictures that are sold for three something i'll show you this very one is sold for three three something can you see look at the price of this thing have their price oranges one is sold for 9.99 these are all the lemons these lemons are huge and beautiful they are sold for 9.99 cents this is another type of oranges sold for three dollars all the limes each one here is sold at almost a dollar 59 cents all of these things if they are tax so this is grape oranges this is grape orange i love grape orange a lot i use it for some amazing recipes sometimes you don't even get this in the store it's sold for two for three dollars that is what it is sold for one is about two dollars one of these is about two dollars plus tax okay this is another type of peach this is another type of peaches so we have different shape of peaches this one is another type of peaches and yeah it is sold for nine it is sold for two forty nine have tangerine tangerine it is sold for 449 if you add tax to be giving you like um, five dollars about that so we are going to be adding some tangerine here going to carry big watermelon so this is apple you can see the difference from peaches can you see this is apple different from peaches this is another apple it's different from peaches so everything here is basically apple and some um, we have some pear here a different shade of pear so this apple this very apple is sold for 199 this very big apple for a pound okay so this apple is sold for two this one is sold for 249 a pound so all of these things are per pound how are you doing are beautiful so we have different shade of apples if you want to see so this is sold for Forty-nine a pound. Also, so yeah, these are apples. You can see it's quite different from peaches. So in case you want to know the difference between peaches and apple, this is apple. Apple is quite different. Like I told you, we have different shade and different types of apples. So this one is another type of apple. We have the very very red apple, which I'm going to be showing you. And here are the green apples. We have the organic and we have the non-organic. So all of these ones are not the organic. Those are organic, yes. 
So I'm very correct. I've been buying this for a long time. <laughs> I've been dealing with fruit for a long, long time. So I know what I'm saying. So all of this was I sold for $1.99 per a pound, you know, a pound. So the same thing as this, the same thing as this. So this is another shape of apple. And this is another type of apple. These ones are pears, a different type of pear. If you look at what it is sold for a pound. What kind of pear is this? In Nigeria, we have a different type of pear. We call that pear. I just say Barlet, but maybe it's Barlet. Oh, this is the, the pear. This is the name. Is it broth? Brothlet pears. Yes. Something like that. Yeah, brothlet. If you can pronounce it very well, please pronounce on the comment section. This is pears. Yeah. Their names are written there. Yeah. So this is it. It's a different type of pear and one of my favorites. One of my favorites. And here we have the red pears also. This is the name for this pear. Red Ajo pears. Whatever it is called. Pronounce it well if you can. So this is the organic. Can you see the organic? The organic apple does not shine as the non-organic. So I like to eat this one. Can you see? This is the one I love to eat. It says organic. Can you see? I'm already where you have the organic, all of the organic vegetables and, and fruits. Yeah. That's how I like to shop. But sometimes people tell me, forget it. When they say organic, it's not really organic. I don't even know what to trust. Well, you know, we can't plant everything. So, guys, yeah. This is the organic. Have you seen this shape? This shape a size of cucumber? Yeah, this one is organic also. And these are the other types of cucumber. You know. I'm gonna go and carry uh watermelon, okay? Let's go. <laughs> so here we have garlic. I like the other type of garlic. And here we have gingers. And yeah, we have chalots. You know this chalot onion is fantastic. This is what is sold at for a pan. And I love all of this tomatoes. I use it for sour sauce. Like comes out very sour and tastes so lovely trust me i think i'm going to be showing you that recipe so there's a lot guys there's a lot you want to do this you're doing another thing you want to do this so this is pear i'm sure this pear is a pear you all know very well you know this is the one you call the avocado pear avocados so it is sold at two for three dollars. We have different shade of tomatoes. This one is another type of tomatoes. Sorry about the noise, guys. It is what it is. When you're out of the house, that is what you get. This is another size. It's another big size of avocado. The other one was bigger. Okay, this is, this is another one. This is another one, guys. Another tomato. It is called hot house tomatoes. Wow. We use this for salad. One is another tomatoes. I bet you all know this shape. <laughs> Romaine tomatoes. Okay, this one is uh, Mexican's products. Oh wow, this one is Mexican's. So yeah, you get this a lot in Mexican cell. In the Mexican 
stores. So here, oh my God, these are awesome, awesome coconuts. This is the price for $4.99. Four ninety-nine for one coconut, guys. I bought about how many of it because I have a recipe that I'm about to do with coconut. So I bought a lot of coconuts. I'll be showing you that recipe soon. Can you guys see plantain? The whole of this store, this is what I, I can see here. Each one is sold at 79 cents. It's even better. The other time I went I went to the farmer's market the other time. I got each of this plantain was sold at one dollar. So I think it's a little better here. You guys see watermelon. Oh my goodness. <laughs> it's a whole lot. It is a whole lot. Mm -mm -mm. Yeah, we are taking one watermelon. We are taking one guys just one it's so oh my god it's full of it's full of food in it if watermelon sound like this you will not say food here and where 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 for real here we have granules look at what it sold at 11.99 for a bag of this granules but I go eat them now. I go eat granite for sure. So you guys see watermelon. Watermelon all over the place. And you guys see watermelon? And you guys see watermelon? The noise is just too much. tomatoes I use it for salad but I have tomatoes now in my garden I'm going to eat salad by the time we get home today but I'm just going to take some vegetables since I'm here already I'll just get some vegetables so I can make some salad for myself and my husband this is the onion I like to use guys Pound is sold at two thirty nine. If you add tax, you know what the price is. So these things. Last time I bought, I bought onion for almost forty dollars. Just two nylon. We did not even fill it up. But it doesn't used to be like that before. But that's because things are very, very, very expensive now. So this is a yellow onion, and this is what I buy each one. Sometimes better sometimes it's it's on the high side they say um one seventy nine a pound and the pound can can just be only two a pound can just be only three sometimes it's not it's not what you expect that you get so this is potatoes if you know potatoes our potato in nigeria the one that is a little white that is called sweet potato this is the organic one two so tell me, sometimes it can be one that is a pound. <laughs> when they say a pound, you think it's like plenty. No, it is not. So this one is another yellow onion. It's called sweet onion. This one is a U.S. product. Okay. Look at what it is. It's looking like. guys know this white onion we use in Nigeria for salad like I remember when we were growing up this is what my mother used to make for salad white onion my elder sister my mother this is what I know my in-law when they make salad when they cook anything that's concerned with salad and all that this is what they use I mean this is what they use this is what they use when they do salad recipes any salad recipes they go with this onion you know but here in america they go with red onion yeah i've worked in so many restaurants here since i came here and what 
we use for our salad is red onion. And this one says red onion sweets. This one is the US product. See? This one is a, the this one is a US product. And another yellow onion. I love this one a lot. This one is US products. One nineteen for a pound. It's another one. The potatoes. I use this for my seafood recipes. I love this. Uh, this. I love this potato. Red bulk potato. A pound says one forty nine. Another shape. So I use this for my curry sauce recipes and all whatnot. And then I use this for my meat pie. I I bake this like regular yam, like you bake yam, like you bake potato. And I use this for mashed potato also. This is what it looks like. So that. also but this is American product and it's yellow inside they love this a lot the Americans love this a lot so guys I'll be running out because my husband will be waiting for me so guys see corn and you guys see corn here is quite expensive see how much it is so that this is US product it doesn't even like our corn, it's so watery, but it's sweet though. What do we do? You see how much corn for two dollars? Somebody saw corn on my recipe the other time and said, Oh, so corn is here. Yeah, corn is here, my love. Corn is here, but it's very expensive. These things are here, but honestly, honestly, they are quite expensive, very, very compared to Nigeria family, friends, and loved ones, you guys are enjoying in Nigeria, I promise you. You guys are enjoying, for real. This is bell pepper, this is what it is sold at. One red bell, look at what it is sold at, almost two dollars. For one, guys, for one. The same thing as this orange bell. The same thing as this orange bell. This one is sold two for three dollars, so you can imagine this yellow bell too is sold at this price. Two for three dollars. And this is the green bell guys. It is sold at 79 cents. So guys, these things are not cheap. Call it taro root. It is sold three forty-nine a pound. Sometimes you don't even see it. This one is yuca root. Two two seventy-nine a pound. I love eggplant a lot. I use it for a special sauce recipe. Go check it on my channel. You will see it. See, see how much it is sold. Sold at oh each when you look at this plate when you look at this plate it says each each is one dollar seventy nine cents so guys this is okra it's bagged 
I like to buy a whole cake when I go to the African market. I chop it into the sizes I like and I throw it into my freezer. So this is what it is sold at. It's just that bag. Can you see? Three forty nine. So you guys are very lucky. How much will you buy this quantity? How much are you going to say this quantity is in Nigeria or anywhere you are? Let me know where you're watching me from. Let me know how much these things cost where you are. Okay, I will really want to know, please. And here is the almighty turmeric that I usually use for my recipes. Did you see how much this is? This is $3.99. If you put tart, it is almost $4 for this little thing you're seeing here. And I don't have any. I've been looking for this for a while. I'm going to take this now. Nigerians, you guys are enjoying. Trust me. You will not understand it. You guys are really, really enjoying. When I say it, take it. You guys are enjoying. We we'll never compare what you guys are enjoying to what we are going through here. I'm telling you the truth. The prices over there is still very good. Let me know watch this video please just let me see your comments let's interact please let's let's indeed let it organic this one i just took one if i want to make some salad and this is another one green leaf lettuce you guys know this right we have this at least in nigeria this is most of the time i use this to make salad in nigeria back here that's what it is sold at. This one, you remember this one? If you remember this one, let's say yes in the comment section. This is what it is sold at, the red lettuce. Each. So tell me what is this quantity sold at in Nigeria or anywhere you're watching me from. Let's interact, please. The prices of things are so incredible these days that it's not funny at all. It's not. This is another type of spring onion. But this is a very huge one. And I love to use it for my health. pronounce it well let me know each of it is sold at 349 i like to use it for my health it gives me that very good strong strong you know taste strong flavor very good for your soup and your chicken marinade and all of those good stuff and this is a regular spring onion guys the fried rice this is what it is sold at bok choy recipe on my channel go look it up you will love it so each each of this each of this bok choy look at the quantity of what it says 349 349 can you imagine that's to tell you so let me know what i saw somebody's video some time ago that um, bought vegetables in nigerian market and Oh my goodness, those vegetables are sold at very good prices. This three, this 349, you know how much it is right now? $349 in Nigeria is how much? Convert it. A lot of people think we are enjoying a lot here. Yeah, we are enjoying life and all that, but you make the money here, you spend the money here. So this is a squash. This is a yellow squash. Each uh, a, a pound of 
this squad is team 39. I'm here with all my teammates. Yeah. The town is 199. So guys, these things are not they are not cheap. They are not cheap. People think things are cheap in America. That's not true. Who told you that? That's not true at all. This is so much I need to say that. 369. Things are not cheap, guys. Okay? They are not. They are not cheap at all. So sometimes when they say sales, they just take you with a little thing. When they say sales, it doesn't mean that they are bad. It's just that they have brand new ones. They want to replace them from what they already have in the store. So sometimes when some people look up to these sales, a lot of times I don't even have time. When I come here, I don't even see the one that says sales. But I just pick what I have to pick actually because I need to use them. I think this one is more cleaner and more and more brighter. I don't mind. I can go for this one too. Because yeah, these ones are more brighter. I'll take the one I already bought. I'll take it back. I'll remove this one, guys. I'll just go for this one. Where are you watching me from and what are the costs of these items from where you are? I know these things cost differently in different countries, but please leave your comment in the comment section. Let's interact, let's chat. Just let me know what it costs where you are. Are you watching me from Germany, from, from Italy? one of these mangoes are <laughs> one of these mangoes are one dollar plus so check that how much is one dollar in Nigeria check for me so this pineapples I buy them in uh, fresh market place four dollars for each and they will not deduct one penny but here it's a little cheaper but you can imagine when you buy one pen apple for four dollars. Check, check how much four dollars is. Check how much four dollars is in Nigeria and see what I'm talking about. The prices are so good where you are. Trust me. <laughs> Trust me, guys. Bananas. This one says. Tell me how much banana of this size is in Nigeria. Just tell me. And here is the organic banana. Tell me how much it says in Nigeria. I'm going to take this one. Let me know where you're watching me from and what the size of banana costs where you are watching me from. Probably like banana a lot, so we don't have any at home. So 
so I'll just take this to set a pop. I already got watermelon and all the rest of them for our family. So guys, I'll see you when I see you. Thank you for coming with me. God bless you. Who wants to marry you? Show that your face. We could let them come and take you out. I'm Zoeke. Can you raise your head? <laughs> because they tell me I did she go she gap war. The guy gave me she only gave me only gave me so. That's wonderful. The band they put an ego very well. <laughs> At least they will give us loan. I will. The Romansion in America. I didn't care of photo Anya man. My picking no go marry on your to Anya. My picking Aga Halo, your to Anya. They lay who knows you, Shiroka. I will be your life. I will Wow. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. A chum chidare, I am with his sugar. A chum chidare, I like his sugar, neither my husband. A man shall know who that day. Eh, he happy and knock, Pokoro. In my car, I'm questioning, I question a celebrated man. Eh? Are you kidding me? I could she celebrate too. Are you kidding me? They could shake what people here have their more again. Oh, was she? I share me, they have their celebrate here. I could she celebrate in this house. Maybe you want to take me and Auntie Lizzie. So that is so that is so that is you guys look at my Auntie Lizzie. <laughs> look at my wonderful Auntie, our great actress, our veteran. Hello. Oh Lord Jesus. I'm so grateful I met her today. I am grateful. One of awesome. one. I love you so much. Thank you. I've always you. admired her. Oh, her beautiful rose. Her beautiful Sorry. face. You guys look at her. Sorry. She's still shining. We bless God. And a great woman of God today. Oh, God is awesome. You. Amen. He is. He oh, is. God. He I'm is. so happy meeting you, man. I'm glad to meet you, too. It will be my and, honor to just give you a thank you. And she's so cute. <laughs> thank you very much. And she's so cute. She's beautiful. Look at you are. Thank God I met you. Bless baby, you. Bless come you. on, let's bless take a you. picture with her. Come on, baby. See, that's why she dropped me. <laughs> we'll take Sassy. a picture. Are you gonna no, get we'll just take a picture here. Okay, okay. Yeah, you hold it. Hold it. Okay, let him say. Uh -huh. Okay. So we can get. You guys uh -huh. look at us. Are you going to tap it? I'll tap it. I came to her sister's house with my hubby. I should have said the female. We came to see her sister, her elder sister. <laughs> Little did I know that she's related to that, my auntie. <laughs> this world is a small world. Mm, we thank God. I'm nice proud of you, you guys. Thank, thank you so much. God bless, God bless you, my dear. I'm you so happy to <laughs> see you. I feel like screaming, guys. <laughs> I feel like screaming, but you know, I don't want to bother daddy. Daddy's relaxing. I don't want to bother him. <laughs> it's my honor. Thank you. It's email from Helen. Please yes. come, come this way. Oh, for everybody. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because how are you going to? I'll take it. Let me see a photographer. 
<laughs> okay, okay, if not anything, we are not. Okay. Daddy, you come closer. Uh, you, you're not seeing him, though. You see in the head. You see in the head. <laughs> no, you're not going to get it. It's okay, let's just uh, let three of us go. Okay. Okay. you want to come closer. Okay. That's my auntie, you all. <laughs> <laughs> my darling what? auntie, such a, a wonderful job. woman, <laughs> such an amazing wow. woman. Uh, <laughs> that's what you can take. Because if you have to get the payment, you have to go that stuff. Yeah. I think you did pretty good, my dear. I like to have a lot of grapes, but the girls I have here will not let my grapes rest. And I buy grapes for my recipes. All they do is keep picking it and picking it until it is all gone. You know. Now you ask, they will say, I didn't touch it. Oh. I didn't touch it. And you'll be wondering, did spirits come and touch the grapes? So funny. <laughs> what you see sometimes. So, guys, I'm adding some eggs. My husband said he wants just one. In this salad, hmm. are you loving it? And this would be for my husband because he said he doesn't want too much, so I will just do this to beautify it, you know. That is it, just to make it look beautiful. Look at that. And this is the remaining for me. Mm, you guys, from one to ten, or from one to hundred, rate this salad for me, guys. Rate this salad, guys. Rate it. <laughs> this is all beautiful. Another thing my husband likes to add is some cheese. How is that salad coming, guys, for you? This is some mozzarella cheese, guys. This is my nuts. This is my walnut. You guys, I'm going to cut out the recipe for this salad and I'll send it out first and then I'll send the vlog much later. This is it, guys. This salad came out so beautiful that I need to just show you guys the recipe. <laughs> this is very healthy. You can decide to make this your meal for the day, guys. Beautiful, beautiful. We had fun. We had fun. I met Auntie Lisi. If you all know Auntie Lisi, um, that acted some interesting Nollywood videos. If you remember Auntie Lisi that acted in Nollywood those days. We met her today and it was a pleasure. If I have told you guys before, I don't think I have, that I almost acted movies. I almost, but my parents didn't allow me because of God's calling upon my life. My mother was really scared. She was thinking that, you know, that would take me out from the purpose of God for my life. But that was one of my dream one thing i have always wanted to do because i act movies in church i was one of the you know drama leaders in my church in my ministry and um, yeah i was part of drama ministry and i was always good in acting so we met her today and it was it was amazing that we did and it was quite fascinating to have given her back like life. I never met her, but I met other actresses like Regina Askia. Um, if you guys remember Anne and Germanze, we were supposed to act a movie called Deborah and the Dragon. We went for the 
audition we went several times to Lampak Hotel if you live anywhere close to Orile if you know what I'm saying that was where we were going for that um, um, you know audition Lampak Hotel and we started from Ijesha Ijesha was where the Nollywood office was then we I met Charlie if you know this Charlie that is acting uh, comedy I met um, uh, what is it called, Mr. Ibu, I met um, Andy, I met a um, couple of them, what's the name of this guy that is, um, you know, I've forgotten most of their names, but a lot of them that I met those days, even Ada that died today, were almost neighbors, you know, those days when we were growing up, so I was really opportune to have to act with them, so yeah, we have a lot of stories from where we're coming from. A lot of people don't know that people have stories of where they started from, of where they are coming from. But thank God for today anyway. So I hope you have enjoyed this vlog. Okay, enjoy it and please give me a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't done so already. And please be kind, be loving, be merciful. God loves the merciful heart. Ciao, ciao. See you in my next video.